Did you know that India, with a population of over 1.3 billion inhabitants, is the world's largest democracy? It's a kaleidoscope of vibrant colors, rich flavors, and diverse cultures coalescing into a single, dynamic entity. Imagine a country where over 2,000 distinct ethnic groups share their lives, traditions, and customs, each contributing to the bright mosaic of Indian society. A country where more than 1,900 languages are spoken, reflecting the incredible diversity and complexity of its people. From the snow-capped peaks of the Himalayas in the north to the sun-kissed beaches of Kerala in the south, from the bustling cityscapes of Mumbai and Delhi to the tranquil tea gardens of Assam, India is a tapestry of varied landscapes, each with its unique charm and character. India, the birthplace of four of the world's major religions, Hinduism, Buddhism, Jainism and Sikhism, is a testament to the country's deep-seated spirituality. It's a place where ancient traditions and modernity coexist harmoniously, where the echoes of time-honored practices resonate amidst the hum of contemporary life. As the world's largest democracy, India stands as a symbol of people power. Its political structure is a testament to the democratic ideals that have been nurtured and upheld since its independence in 1947. With the right to vote granted to every adult regardless of gender, caste, or religion, India exemplifies the principles of equality and freedom. But India's story does not end with these facts. It is a country that continues to evolve, to change, and to surprise. It is a place where every street corner has a story to tell, every festival a tradition to impart, and every person a piece of the grand Indian narrative to share. So buckle up, dear listeners, as we embark on this journey of exploration and discovery, traversing the width and breadth of this fascinating land. Now that we've dipped our toes into the vast ocean of India's present, let's dive deep into the currents of its past. India's history stretches back over 5,000 years, making it one of the world's oldest civilizations. Our journey begins with the enigmatic Indus Valley Civilization, which emerged around 2500 BCE. It was one of the world's first urban cultures, boasting advanced city planning and sanitation systems unmatched for millennia. This civilization was not just a collection of farmers and herders, but a complex society with a distinct culture and system of governance. As the Indus Valley civilization faded, the Vedic period dawned. This era was characterized by the composition of the Vedic texts, the bedrock of Hindu philosophy. The Vedic period marked a significant shift in India's societal structure, transitioning from tribal to settled agricultural communities, setting the stage for major political and cultural transformations. In this transformative period, three major religions took root, Hinduism, Buddhism, and Jainism. These philosophies with their profound teachings would not only shape the Indian society, but also leave an indelible impact on the entire world. Their influence extended beyond spiritual beliefs, permeating every aspect of daily life, from food habits to societal norms, from art to architecture. The Maurya Empire, established in the 4th century BCE, was a testament to the political prowess of ancient India. Under the reign of Emperor Ashoka, it became one of the largest empires of the world, renowned for its administration, military strength, and promotion of Buddhism. Following this, the Gupta Empire, often referred to as the Golden Age of India, flourished. This period witnessed remarkable advancements in arts, science, and political organization. The world was introduced to the concept of zero and the decimal system courtesy of Indian mathematicians. The Gupta period was also known for its magnificent architecture, literature, and the proliferation of performing arts. These ancient civilizations, their cultures, religions, and empires laid the foundation for the India we know today. They were the crucibles of innovation, thought, and societal advancement. From the ancient to the medieval, India's history is a saga of continuous evolution. As we move into the medieval period, India experiences invasions, cultural exchanges, and the rise of mighty empires. In the early part of the medieval era, India saw invasions from Central Asia, which significantly impacted the cultural and political landscape of the country. These invasions introduced new ideas, new religions, and new ways of governance, forever altering the fabric of Indian society. Among the invaders were the Turks, who established the Delhi Sultanate in the 12th century. This marked the beginning of Muslim rule in India which would last for several centuries. The Delhi Sultanate was a melting pot of cultures, with Persian, Turkish and Arabic influences blending with indigenous Indian traditions. 
This period saw the introduction of new architectural styles, the Persian script, and the spread of Islam, especially in the northern parts of India. But the highlight of the medieval period was, without a doubt, the Mughal Empire. Established in the early 16th century, the Mughal Empire is often regarded as one of the most powerful and influential empires in the world. It was under the Mughals that India reached its zenith in terms of economic prosperity, cultural richness, and architectural grandeur. The Mughals were great patrons of art, literature, and architecture, and their reign saw the construction of some of India's most iconic structures. From the majestic Taj Mahal to the imposing Red Fort, the Mughal architectural style is a testament to the empire's grandeur and sophistication. But perhaps the most enduring legacy of the Mughals was the syncretic culture they fostered. This was a period of great cultural exchange, with Persian, Indian, and Islamic traditions merging to create a unique blend of art, literature, music, and cuisine. It was a time when the Ghazal, a form of Persian poetry, found its way into the hearts of Indians. It was a time when Indian cuisine was enriched with Persian and Central Asian flavors. The winds of change were soon to blow over India, bringing with them the echoes of a far-off land. The medieval period was a time of great dynamism and change, setting the stage for the events that were to come in the centuries that followed. The 17th century marked the beginning of European colonization, a period that would forever alter India's trajectory. The first European power to set foot in India was Portugal, but it was the British who would eventually control the subcontinent. The East India Company, a British corporation, was established in the early 17th century. It was initially a commercial entity seeking to monopolize the spice trade. However, as it gained a foothold, its ambitions grew. By the mid-18th century, the East India Company had evolved into a political power, controlling vast territories and commanding private armies. The company's rule was not benevolent. It exploited India's resources, imposed high taxes, and disregarded the local customs and traditions. This period saw a drastic change in India's economy, society, and culture. Traditional industries were destroyed, and an English-based education system was introduced, creating a new class of Indians who were culturally more British than Indian. The Indian Rebellion of 1857 marked a turning point. It was a large-scale rebellion by soldiers in the company's army, triggered by the company's insensitivity to local religious sentiments. The rebellion was brutally crushed, but it exposed the company's inability to govern India effectively. The British Crown took direct control of India marking the beginning of the British Raj. Under the crown, India was further integrated into the global economy, but primarily as a supplier of raw materials and a market for British goods. The British also invested in infrastructure, building railways, telegraph lines, and modern ports. However, these developments primarily served the interests of the colonial power. The colonial period left a deep impact on India. It disrupted the traditional social structure, introduced new political and legal systems, and fostered a sense of national identity among Indians. The English language and Western education created a new intellectual class that began to question British rule. The seeds of rebellion were sown, and soon they would sprout into a struggle for independence. The 20th century dawned with the clamor for freedom echoing across India. As the world welcomed a new century, India was in the throes of a struggle for independence. This was a battle fought not with weapons, but with words, ideas, and nonviolent resistance. At the heart of this revolution was a man whose name became synonymous with peace and freedom, Mahatma Gandhi. His philosophy of Satyagraha, or truth force, proved to be a powerful tool in dismantling the chains of colonial rule. In the aftermath of World War II, the cries for independence could no longer be ignored. In 1947, a partition was implemented, leading to the creation of two separate nations, India and Pakistan. This event was marked by a mixture of joy and sorrow, as independence came with the painful reality of division and displacement. But as the sun rose on a free India, so too did it illuminate the challenges that lay ahead. Building a new nation from the ashes of colonial rule was no easy task. Yet, India proved equal to the challenge. The nation embarked on a journey of transformation, fueled by the indomitable spirit of its people. Post-independence India has witnessed significant economic growth. From being an agrarian economy, it has evolved into a global player in information technology, space research, and manufacturing. The nation's progress is not just limited to economic milestones. Social changes, 
such as the empowerment of women and marginalized communities, have also been a part of India's journey towards a more inclusive society. Technological advancements have revolutionized the way Indians live, work, and connect. The rise of Digital India is a testament to this transformation. Today, India stands tall as a dynamic and diverse nation, etching its unique imprint on the global stage. From an ancient civilization to a vibrant modern nation, India's journey is a testament to the resilience and diversity of its people. The story of India is one of triumph against odds, of unity in diversity, and of a constant quest for progress. It's a story that continues to unfold, promising many more exciting chapters in the years to come.